thank you for joining us on the News at 11 on this Thanksgiving evening. I'm Rafael Sanchez in for Mark and Amanda. RTV6 has spent the day working for you, learning more about a group's efforts to save lives and spreading the word about thieves who hit a local business. We begin with that tonight. Unique Limousine on the southwest side of Indianapolis is sharing these surveillance videos, hoping that someone recognizes the thieves who stole the catalytic converters from some of their company vehicles. RTV6's Cameron Riddle shows you why a crime that could happen to anyone is hitting this business especially hard. On a day when many of us are giving thanks, an Indianapolis limo company is dealing with an early Grinch who stole Thanksgiving and three catalytic converters. As the buses at Unique Limousine start up, The roar of the engine doesn't last very long. Tuesday night, these guys came and stole Cadillac converters off our buses. The suspected thieves were caught on camera overnight Tuesday into Wednesday morning. Zell says they hit two buses with gas engines and one with diesel. On top of the repair costs, the diesel bus won't even run and will now have to be towed to the shop. The theft is causing problems for a business that takes pride in its fleet. Cadillac converters help silence the running vehicles. And with a limousine service, it's all about luxury. And nobody wants to get into a bus that's loud. Zell says this isn't the first time the bus yard has been hit. She said thieves visited the lot in both 2017 and 2018. And each time it puts the company, its drivers, and their customers in a bind. To go to your bus with a run, you get to your bus. All the other buses are booked. You get to your bus, you start it, and it's running weird. Now you can't take that bus to your customer because you don't want them to complain. You want to look good. Replacing a catalytic converter on a bus isn't cheap. I heard one of the buses is about seven grand just to replace the catalytic converter. Now the company is offering a $500 reward if the stolen parts are returned and a $1,000 reward for anyone who recognizes the suspected thieves and turns them in. This is the week of Thanksgiving. You're supposed to be thankful. And it's hard to be thankful when a situation like this happens. Working for you on the West Side, Cameron Riddle, RTV6. Uh, the theft of catalytic converters come in waves. Insurance companies recommend uh, getting special devices called a cat clamp or a cat strap to prevent these th thefts or even welding your converter to the frame of your vehicle.